Eight months ago, a Philadelphia church opened its doors to Ukrainian refugees. Today, those refugees celebrated their first Thanksgiving. Eyewitness News reporter Madeline Wright joined them for the special occasion in Northern Liberties. This is the event hall where St. Nicholas Patriarchal Orthodox Cathedral is hosting 14 Ukrainian refugees for Thanksgiving. Many refugees got separated from their loved ones when they fled their homeland, so the other refugees have become family. With a song and a prayer, Ukrainian refugees joined with church members as they celebrated their first Thanksgiving. I feel excited because it is my first one because it's Thanksgiving in, in USA in Philly. In March, St. Nicholas Patriarchal Orthodox Cathedral opened up its doors to the 14 refugees. Ala Puktetska worked as a theology teacher at a church in Kyiv that connected her with this Philadelphia church. Although America is a safe place, but still, every day we read news about bombing Kyiv. Puktetska is worried about her cousins in Ukraine she left behind when she escaped the war. She's grateful her 20 year old daughter Natalia is safe in France, and she also gives gratitude to this church. We are very thankful to Bishop Luke to send Pedro Hillary for this opportunity to stay here. On this special day, it's all about celebrating with the American traditions of turkey, stuffing, and pumpkin pie. A couple people called me, say, Bishop, can we bring some kielbasa? I say, no, 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 please, just cake. While they enjoy the new family they've made here in Philly, the refugees hope one day to return to their homeland. Maybe the worst time is behind and the future is ahead and we have to be thankful with American society for such a possibility. Now that Thanksgiving is winding down, the church is getting ready for the next big dinner, Christmas. In Northern Liberties, Madeline Wright, CBS3 Eyewitness News.